Hello, and welcome to School Tycoon. It is a game way from the early 2000s, and it's a pretty, I'd say mediocre tycoon game. Um, obviously the premise is you get to run a school, and I guess we can go through the tutorial first. have buildings Pretty simple. It was a really short tutorial, but I prefer it over modern ones that has like a starting scenario and you can't get out of it. Reach an enrollment of 10 students and a star rating of at least 1 out of 5 stars. Okay. Jeez. Loading screen has to load up as its own thing. A nice 3D that we got for the graphics. Let's pause. Oh, I can't do anything when pause. That's not nice. Yeah, let's get some classrooms going. And hire some teachers. get some facilities as well. So, I have played this. It's been a really long time. Um, it wasn't really that good of a game, to be honest, and we'll see some of the issues with that. One of the biggest issues was whenever you save the game, your money and like spills and stuff all gets corrupted when you reload, which is bizarre. Jeez, I don't like this perspective that they give us. Oh, that is not easy on the eyes. was pretty simple.
Maybe we should not do the challenges. Let's just do a normal game. So yeah, we gotta get the basics. I guess we could go for... some more... stuff... social studies? Okay. I have no idea how the pathfinding is in this game. I don't know if having like a big path is nice or not nice or what. Pretty simple. We'll try and go for what we were doing earlier. Uh, yeah, I didn't know the challenge was not going to be consecutive. There should be something for like policies and stuff that you can do as well, or change. When you click on a uh, classroom, you can kind of see like a little window. There we go. Don't think there's any use to this, it's just... ...seeing people do stuff. But yeah, you can definitely tell this is an early 2000s game, with like, the graphics and all that. Yeah, we'll get some of those bigger subjects eventually. Detention Center. Teacher's Lounge. That's huge. I don't think I need that around my glasses. So let's put that down here. the decorations do very much. Maybe they do, but... Not sure. Where are you going? What the heck? There's nothing up there. 
Uh, our athletics are suffering because I didn't build a gym. That's kind of important. Definitely should do that. Coach. I believe you can send the teachers to like training or something. Mm hmm. A detention center needs to be built. Is that so? Yeah, there's no way we can get out of this isometric view, but it's not too bad. It just looks a little bit weird, especially with this resolution. Yeah, it seems to be a bit better in the uh, video feed versus what I actually get to see, so you get to see it fine. Look at that, our janitor's actually cleaning up the floors and stuff. Good. Looks like we have access to more stuff. Portable biology. We just want cheap teachers so far. I believe you can also make entertainment facilities. Yeah, but we don't want those just yet. Those come a bit later. Nurse's office. Do we need one? No staff required. Oh, okay. Good. Uh, this guy is just totally ignoring the dirty floors. You have stupid teachers. What? Oh man, and my pathways are getting filthy. So my janitor is just not doing anything. Uh, let's look at her budget. Okay, that shows us profit and income at least. I mean, that's normal for tycoon-like games, but... No food! Do I need an actual cafeteria? There we go. Well, where's my janitor? What the heck? Hey, why are you running up there? Quit that. Please clean, like, over here. Do I need, like, fences to keep them in? I 
I guess I could invest in that. All the fences are valued the same, that's cool. Oh no, you have to do it individually? That is... not... good. So I think this is supposed to be like a high school, what I can gather. Not really running like any other early grades or anything. Where's my janitor? Again? Oh, he's cleaning over there. Well, stop going over there. Please clean like the actual messy spots. Thank you. Now let's check our finances. We are losing money. Food is expensive. Jeez. I can't, like, adjust anything for that. Okay, so there's nothing for, uh, like... You can't manage anything? That's kind of dumb. Like, you can't decide teaching policies and stuff. Why is this guy just walking away from the dirty messes? Yeah, the big thing is, like, the AI seems pretty bad for pathfinding and stuff. I was kind of worried that this game would do that. I suppose we could alleviate it by building more path. Let's see... Well, we're still getting money. I'd like to know what we need, though. Says we need more morale here, but I don't know. Increasing morale would either be fun teachers or like building an arcade. Oh, geez, you can build a roller coaster. Oh, that's how you unlock buildings. Okay. And once again, he pathfinds towards the statue. is pretty messy. I don't want to have to hire another staff for that. I need a teacher for the library. That should unlock. Yeah, we get the computer lab and the chemistry and a workshop. Those seem upper class. Wands. Oh. 
Yeah, I guess having like actual lawns would be nice. Okay. Those are for me. I thought there was like advertising or something. What else can I go with? Detention center? Nurse office? Teacher lounge? Ah, uh, we need another Janny. Here we go. Okay, please don't like mess up and pathfind your way over here for some reason. This seems not good to build, but sure, let's do it. going down into the toilet. That's not good. That might be teacher morale. In which case, I'd have to build a teacher lounge. Should probably build that a bit closer to the uh, classrooms, like right here. There we go. Yeah, we can build a few more labs. Let's try the computer lab. Yeah, I don't remember this game being very hard, but I mean it might be. We'll see. There's no loan system or anything. I know a lot of Tycoon games would do that. Jesus, our paths are so dirty. And this one guy is still just cleaning the statue. I think that's better, but dang, that gets dirty so fast. going into the computer lab. Cool. What is this? Oh, 
Oh, I don't really want that. Oh, yeah, that looks so off. I kind of just would prefer the trees. This is so filthy. Dude. Leave this statue alone. I'm gonna sell this. We clearly do not need a statue if you're going to just sit there and clean it all day. And he still pathfinds his way over. That's great. Dude, you're like totally ignoring this path. It's kind of frustrating. Food poisoning in the cafeteria? Wait, but it's a soda machine. Huh? Should probably do a maintenance building as well. Food poisoning. How are the candy machines giving food poisoning? English classroom needs maintenance? Well, that's why I hired the maintenance guy. Where'd he go? Um... Yeah, where's the maintenance guy? He's working. He's not pathfinding to where he should. Oh no. This building is on fire. It's a math school thing. You can't light that on fire. What the heck? How do I get rid of it? Oh no, it's spreading. Can I bulldoze it? No. No bathroom? There's one right there. Bruh, he just repaired this. I guess I need another maintenance guy. There goes my math school. You have a full gem. 
gym, whatever. This is... Yeah, this is not going as planned. I mean, we still have money, I'm just not spending it for some reason. Should definitely build more classrooms and stuff. Make students. You can also make havoc. Tornado, earthquakes, and hurricanes. Well, that's nice that they have like the SimCity thing in there where you can mess stuff up if you really want to. Why are you here? I don't know why it doesn't use like a heat map and be like, oh hey, there's lots of dirt here. Send all the janitors to this area. Yeah, my school's kind of dirty. Basketball gym. Let's get the army, dude. What? You're kidding. My poor tree. I need to hire a landscaper. It's not my fault there's food poisoning. The tornado just came in and destroyed it. Oh no. Well, the computer lab is screwed. That's awesome. Nothing I could do about that. Oh, oops. Not want to move the entire building. Yeah, repair this. So apparently, having it at half maintenance means that it's really bad, so that's not cool. I'm glad that the wood shop at least works. Should probably go for an art school too. And a music school. There. Now what? Oh, the computer lab just got destroyed. We should already have a teacher that needs to go there. I wish there was a way to tell if someone was attached to a building or not. Oh my gosh, these guys do nothing. You must build more janitor buildings to hire more staff. That that's kind of stupid. 
pretty sure these take maintenance. Maybe they don't. Where's all my students? My school should be... good. It says I have 32 of them. Let's see. I have all the basic classes except chemistry. I guess I should get a chemistry lab. There we go. I can see my report card, but it doesn't really seem to do anything. Yeah, this game seems to lack a lot of just information and control. And sometimes the pathfinding is kind of stupid, like why aren't the janders going here? Bankrupt. Well, I need more students to enroll. There's some students. I should get an intuition when they enroll. Doesn't look like they... They're not giving me any money? Commands? Oh, jeez. Maybe they pay for individual classes. No? Well, it's a shame that we can't build, like, the later tier buildings. Although they're really just bigger versions of the previous ones. Yeah, I don't really see any... <sighs> you can't tell me I'm bankrupt. What the heck? Aren't I supposed to be getting money? Let's see, I can sell the landscaping. And find my landscaper. He's fired, that should save me some cash. Let's set it to 4x speed. Ooh, the janitor's actively ignoring the dirty path. It's good to know. No bathroom, what the heck? Oh, there's one right there. Maybe I should build one here. Why are you going down? 
there. Let's get another janitor office. That is a strange janitor office, but whatever. I hope those guys don't stack on top of each other. That would be kind of bad. They are stacking on top of each other. That's great. They're not even cleaning pathway that's like dirty. They are just cycling through the exact same pathways over and over. While everything else gets dirty. That's awful. Um, yeah, I don't get it. Decorations. Yeah, I'll just sell these. No more trees. Is there like stuff that I can build to prevent this? Is there like pathway things? What's this? A trash bin. Well, I wish I knew I, I could build that. It's a huge bench. Okay, hopefully that helps with the garbage issue. I did not know you could build trash cans, though. And they're still actively ignoring pathways, though. Just dumb. We have a lot of money. I don't think I need to play on 4X anymore. Let's build some, like, actual facilities. Uh, bigger entertainment? Sure. Let's... I think arcades are actually bad. Let's not build one of those. You must first build the pizzeria. That is... yeah, that's a pizzeria. Food. That's a lie. There's food. Yeah, I get the feeling this would make more sense if it was like a college sim or tycoon. But I don't know. Oops. That should raise morale or whatever. That is huge. They don't give me a lot of land to work with either. Alright, let's have a mini golf. Lawns should on honestly have like a fill option. Mm. 
We should probably get bigger classrooms too. Oh, I'm not hiring. Oh, I am hiring teachers. There we go, there's another. Okay, my stats are increasing slowly. So we're turning it around. It's not all bad. need a coach. Okay, this is pretty good so far. I mean, I thought it was bad, but it's getting better, at least. I think people are mostly coming here for the, uh... What a weird building to have as a bathroom. What the heck? Sure. Um, I, th I think people are mostly coming for the mini golf, but yeah. Um, why are they stacking? Another tornado? Are you serious? Yeah, I hate that. There's a way to turn that off, right? Okay, let's exit. Well, I think we saw enough. It's an okay game. Can't change your settings at all, and can't, like, turn off disasters and stuff. It's kind of unfortunate, but other than that, it was kind of neat. That was School Tycoon. I wouldn't say it's a great game, but I guess it's a nice take on the genre. It definitely could have used more depth. 
It had some issues, like the pathfinding with those maintenance dudes, or displaying a lot of information, like where your income comes from, and some of the finer details. Like, if you remember the SimCity games, they would always have the Ornits. Is that the right pronunciation? Whatever. You you could like change the rules and be like, okay, regulate recycling or water saving conservation stuff or tax parking and stuff like that. Um, this game doesn't have any of that, which is kinda lame. And bizarre because you would think that would be in a school game. There's not really like a good way to tell how students are doing, like, it's a bit difficult to set up a format where you have a school year and students show up and, like, yeah, it's just weird. Because apparently that was only, like, what, 20 days? And we had expelled many people we don't know if they take classes, or what grade they're in, anything like that. So that's kind of strange. Maybe that information is there, I didn't look very hard for it, but whatever. Um, anyway, that was school taken. So, it was pretty cool. Uh, until next time, see ya.